Man, where the heck is Streetcar Joe? Joe, where you at? Absolutely, buddy. I think we need to go. Hey, everyone, thousand likes on this video. Let's see it. All right, what's today? Dave. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. It's Streetcar Friday. Oh, well, Doesn't look. everyone take their streetcars on Fridays? Of course. I do. Most people go to work though, Joe. <laughs> I was working from home today. Oh, yeah. It's lunchtime. Oh shit, I hate getting in this thing. Easy. Oh, I need to put a tune-up in it real quick. Well, what do you need a tune-up for? Well, actually, this <laughs> tune-up would probably be slow on the streets. Get the Roswell tune-up in it. Uh, Our, where did we go? Yeah, Hobbs. Hobbs, it's got the Hobbs tune in it. If you want to feel a slow car, let me uh, put that one in it. How are you, Dave? Great. Now that I'm here. It's a heavy door. Do you start your street car up here? Oh. Uh. <laughs> Yes, in New Mexico. <laughs> For real. Good point. It's kind of hot. What's up? Let's roll down the window. Power window. Hey, do you have a seatbelt? Yeah. Do you? No. <laughs> you should get a seatbelt. At least you're not sitting on the floor anymore. I mean, it's true. Like, come on, look where you come from. Be thankful for what you have. <laughs> my door. <laughs> hey, let me put this in my trunk back here. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Easy. <laughs> Perfect. 
Angus House must be next weekend for the flash water race. Yeah, it's like those people knew you won it over. So you got turning signals. I got turning signals. I mean, how else do you signal in your street car that it's like, hey, I need over? You put on your turn signals, babe. I can't relate. <laughs> I got headlights and stuff, too. I got the horn. Yeah. Yeah. Beep, beep. <laughs> you know. Close enough. One of these buttons is the horn, I forget which. How's you run on the street, Joe? Nice and cool. Yeah, can't complain. It was like, I don't know, I mean, it wasn't a long drive. It's like five or six miles to O'Reilly's. So it's stop and go traffic. Yeah, stop and go 10, mi 10 miles, and yeah, it's not even up to operating <laughs> tip yet. Good old <laughs> methanol. Methanol. <laughs> We just did 10 15 miles. <clears throat> I was gonna say it's 12 to 15 for sure. Over 10, yeah, because it went that all the way down is, I think it's five to six, yeah. So I'm gonna say 15. Was Stop it full? and go traffic. Was it full when you left? Yeah, hold on. Damn. Oh, yeah, that's over. Damn, what's the uh, estimated MPGs on that? Mm, that tastes like methanol. <laughs> oh, gosh, mm, I love methanol ice cream, yeah. <laughs> Um, so no, I would say we probably, because I didn't have it all the way full. It was probably that much from the top, probably another gallon or two. So we probably use, I said use three to four gallons that's for 15 miles. That's like four miles of a gallon. <laughs> <laughs> Is that right? Yeah, I couldn't use four gallons though. No. If it's over half and I had a gallon. No, it probably used like two, two to three gallons. That's probably right. Two to three, <laughs> 15 miles, five, maybe a little better. That's, I'd say six to eight is what I think I get. Damn. Uh, I mean, six to eight ain't bad. Yeah, you know. But no, I can fit almost 10 gallons, so that means I can go, 
I think I can go at least 60 miles. Like, especially if it was a highway cruise. You gotta think we idled just everywhere. All the yeah. stoplights. We should see how far it takes us to get to run out. <laughs> I've run out once. <laughs> well, how far was that? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It was one of the times I was trying to switch it from methanol to pump gas. So I was trying to get it real ah, low, yeah. and then I died like just not <laughs> far from the house. That's embarrassing. I was pretty bad. <laughs> Yeah. How was it, Dave? It was great. Rad's good, Rad's you know. Good. Pull's good. Pull's good. Pull's pretty good on five well, to ten thousand boots. Yeah. Dude, you should have gave away your new secret. What? Your new CO2 secret. <laughs> <laughs> Joe won't give away all the secrets. Look at that paint, though. The reflection. Oh man, I had a GoPro. Oh, you should have put the GoPro on. Yeah, I wanted to put the GoPro on the windshield. That would have been good footage. All right, let's do it all over. <laughs> so now my car's all dirty. Only I would think, oh, I'll go cruise it around, enjoy it, and now it's dirty. So whatever, got to clean it up. I'm going to take it back to storage, actually. So I'm debating going testing tomorrow. The flashlight race is one week away, and I can't determine if I need to test tomorrow or not. I got a ton of work to do in the garage, so... I don't know. We'll see. I may go test, maybe last minute decision, or I may just text, test next week for the race. But you can see in the video, like, methanol cruise is pretty good. Like, gets pretty good gas mileage. It drives good. Like, I don't think the car ever got up to operating temp in the cruise we did. Got some ice cream. Of course, we're going to go get some ice cream. So, yeah, I was just going through Friday. Beautiful day out. Want to drive the streetcar. So, that kind of wraps it up. Stay tuned. I got more wiring videos coming for the Camaro. Um, I'm on part three or four now, so more videos come from that. I'm making great progress on it. Making progress on Dave's car as well, so just tons of stuff getting knocked out in the garage. we got tons of footage coming with the flashlight race. We're going to vlog it and get the car ready and the races, so stay tuned for all that. It's going to be really good. So, yeah, we'll just kind of see how it goes. We'll see you guys in the next one.